Hi guys, Katie Lightcamp here. I'm on set of Society Inc. and I'm about to film with Vogue Australia. Sabella so Court, I'm the editor in chief and I'm so excited. I'd love to talk about inspiration. It's something I talk to my team about constantly, that they need to have their antenna up because you never know where inspiration or ideas are going to pop up and you need to be aware or switched on for when they, you know, come about. Um, so yeah, where does inspiration come for you? I get inspired personally from anywhere you look hot enough, um, whether that be nature, travel, shapes, textures, colours. I'd agree with that. It can be as easy as a walk in the Royal National Park or a far-flung location. So how do you decide where to study? Well, I decided to study online with Billy Blue, not only because of their wonderful reputation, but their ability to connect students to the industry and help them establish industry connections and be paired with leaders. Yeah, I think the industry connections is a big one, as well as practical experience. You're Billy Blue's interior design ambassador. What does that actually mean? I am. Well, I get to mentor the students. There's a scholarship in my name, um, and we have got two students already, and I'll be mentoring them as well. And we offer internships. So I'm here to guide the students through the course of their choice. So how important are mentors? Well, I've never really had an official mentor myself, but I always wish that I had. So when I was asked to do this, I got really excited about it. If I can offer any tidbits, you know, I'm happy to do that. It's also very fulfilling as well. It is, and the students that um, I've already got to meet, they're just so full of energy, full of life, and I feel like I get to relive the early years of my career. <laughs> At Billy Blue, we are also provided success coaches when we commence our studies. Amazing. And they're there for us to call, email and text. And I think that's been very valuable to my studies and to help me really navigate my way through so far. What do you both think are the elements of great design? Do you want to start, Katie? I think the elements of great design is when a designer can successfully design a space that's not only harmonious and functional, but as well as sustainable and accessible for everyone to be able to use and enjoy and hopefully leave a long-lasting impression on anyone who's able to experience it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to top that answer. <laughs> um, but great design is always in that eye of the beholder, firstly. Um, but I think things that have longevity and that um, patina with age, so great materials that last a lifetime and just get better and better with age. Um, that's, that's what great design is. What's your one piece of advice for students? I always tell people it's really important to stay curious and keep educating yourself no matter what point you are in your career. I would say to follow your passion and don't be scared to leave your comfort zone and be willing to learn and grow. Yeah, I think it's about enjoying the journey as well. There's all these stepping stones that you pick up along the way and not be too focused on a final goal because that shifts and changes and you can just have a lovely time getting there. Hi. Hi. Yes, Katie. How are you? Good. We're just about to start talking about big breaks, so perfect timing. Ah. Do you consider that you had a big break? Uh, yes, probably. When I got the opportunity to work on a shoot for Vogue, the fashion editor at the time, Victoria Collison, um, gave me gave me that chance um, as a bit of a, a trial, really. And so that was pretty important, I think, in terms of taking a big step. And then again, when I um, worked at The Australian and Marion Hume got me in on a cadetship there and I really wanted to write, and that gave me the opportunity to work in a newsroom, which is really what you had to do um, to have the journalism credentials to, to write well. So, yeah, they were both led by two, two quite extraordinary women. I don't know if I had one big break, but I had lots of highlights in my career um, and a lot of hard work. Yeah, how about you, Jess? I didn't have a big break per se, but I definitely had amazing women, even like yourself, give me amazing opportunities that I've really just tried to run with and make my own. Um, so I think when you are given those opportunities, you really do just have to take them and lean into them as much as possible. What about you, Katie? I think the opportunity of being here today with amazing, inspirational women like yourselves is absolutely the highlight of my Billy really, Blue really experience. And to film with Vogue Australia and have the opportunity to intern with Vogue has made me incredibly excited for the future and to get my foot into the industry. I think we'll be very lucky to have you in that <laughs> fabulous intern program.